It's buzzing in here ahead of game three. And we'll be back in a minute to get it started. Coming to you live from Southern California, MLB The Show brings you the National League Championship Series. The Atlanta Braves taking on the Los Angeles Dodgers. John Shambi on the play-by-play -play with you. Chris Singleton providing the color. We're looking forward to what's sure to be a dramatic Game 3, Chris. Well, when a team starts a series on the road and comes away with a split in the first two games, they've essentially taken over home field advantage. So the last thing these guys want to do now is give it right back by dropping this one. And these and fans know that just as much as the players. And the atmosphere here is electric. And this figures to be about as intense as postseason baseball gets. All right, we'll be back to get this one started after this. Now the third baseman, Joey Wendell. For the Dodgers, the third baseman, Joey Wendell. The 1-1. One -one. Ground ball up the middle. Throw on to Olsen. One up, one down. Batting second, not shortstop, Gavin Lux. So now to the That's plate for Atlanta, King Tejada. He's sort of your typical power hitter. Wouldn't necessarily call him a three true outcome guy, but he's in there to hit home runs. Yeah, and there's nothing wrong with that. Fans dig the long ball, bro. Tapped at the plate, but it's a foul ball. One down, base is empty. Out to short. Throw on to Freeman. Oh. And that is out number two. And stepping in is the speedy King Tejada. He's 0 for 1. He is quite an athlete. I mean, you look around the other sports, basketball, football, you feel like he could thrive in one of those sports too. And first offering is fouled off. Tejada measures six feet even, 200 pounds, and he's a former home run derby champ. Well, pretty clear to me, he was trying to go deep right there, but you gotta get a pitch that you can handle. And ball one. Murphy off of first with two away. Next offering is fouled back. All right, come on now, let it fly. Here comes a pitch. Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. The one two foul ball left side he'll see another also really good at bat what I like about this guy his bat stays in the zone for a long time gives him the ability to foul off tough pitches kicks and fires ground ball left side and it goes just foul and a pitch out to short Lux they take the force out and that is that. But two ready to go for the last leading half of the inning. The leading Dodgers. off, Will Smith. The catcher. Will. Well, after scoring runs, this is where you're looking for that shutdown inning. Get that hot team back in there to swing the bats. On the ground to the left. Throw on to Olsen, and they get the out on Smith. Batting eight, the center fielder, Fred. Taylor. Back here at the ballpark. Here's Joey Wendell. The third baseman. Right back to work. Wendell. Tapped on the ground softly to short. Tejada. 
Whips it to first. Lead off hitter retired in the fourth. Good slider inside right there. Yeah, Batter fighting That's to get there. Shot. Just rolled over it. Yeah, got the ground ball. Here's Shohei Otani. Grounded out his first time. Two outs. And one in scoring position. Swing and a base hit. Lux around third. Throws to second. The tag and they cut him down going for two. But one run does score on the play before the inning ends. So it's one run, two hits, no errors, and nobody left on. On to the top of the fifth we go. It's the Braves two and the Dodgers one. And next for Atlanta, King Tejada. Pretty amazing athlete this guy is. Power and speed, quite a threat. I mean, you're talking about someone that could steal your bag and go deep. Bo Jackson, anyone? Sharp grounder. That's through for a base hit. Here comes Olsen around third. He scores, and they lead by four. Couldn't get any air under it, but he smoked that ball back up the middle. Timing was just perfect. Got great wood on it, and there was just no chance for the infielders with how hard he hit it. Here's Jesse Winker. That's down and in. He's like Mike Trout. You figure whatever you put in his hand, whether it's a bat, whether it's a golf club, whether it's a basketball, he can do it and get it done. And a rare talent, so much fun to watch. The 3 1. Ah! Murphy oh, no. at second. Tahada on at first with nobody out. Three, two. Knocks that one away and we'll do it again. The healthy cut. Tough pitch at 98, but a really good pass at the ball. The three, two is off the outside edge, and that is ball four. Oh, looking for a swing and miss right there or for the ump to help him out and make a call with that last pitch, but neither happened. Close pitch, but a good take to earn that walk. The 3-1. Swing and a foul over the screen and back out of play. They need a strikeout and you need a ball perhaps on the ground for a double play or get yourself a pop-up or something, but you've got to make some pitches. But if he can battle and get through this, he can earn some points. He's really gotten himself into a mess out there and now forces home a run with the wall. This inning's definitely getting away from him. Now the leadoff spot for the Braves, Michael Harris. The next offering misses, and it's 2-1. and one. Well, this is a tough situation with the bases loaded, but the healthiest mindset is just try to get outs, one hitter at a time. 2-1 now. That's a strike. With the big bats coming up and a home run already surrendered, he's really going to have to execute against these next couple of batters. 2-2 two, two now. Stays alive. The 2-2. Spoils the two-strike pitch, and he'll see another. Left-hand batter waits. Good eye right there. Good slider down and in can be so hard to get on plane with. You're better off taking that pitch. That one is absolutely belted. Betts going back on this one. That'll touch down off the base of the fence. Across is the runner from first. And it's an eight-run lead. Nice and bad right there. Not just the result, but also seeing a lot of pitches. Made him really work out there on the mound. Just missed out on a home run right there, but he certainly hit it hard enough. Just didn't have the right launch angle to carry it over the wall. But still an excellent swing of the bat. 
And welcome back. Here's Mookie now. Singing, you can't ask for anything more. This guy checks all the boxes offensively. He is the ultimate professional, and it doesn't just start at game time. It starts in the afternoon the way he prepares and gets ready for the ball game. I tell you what, his teammates feed off. Oh, look at this. To first. And the leadoff man set down in their half of the fifth. A quick move to his left, fully extended there in front of the shortstop to make the grab. Up with it, then a strong, accurate throw across the diamond to complete this highlight play. Back here at Dodger Stadium. All right, we go to the top half of inning number six. Stepping in, the long ball threat, King Tejada. And here it comes. And first offering is fouled off. Nelson, a 6-6 righty. 250 pounds, and he was a second-round pick back in 2010. Hard hit, left side. Lux throws the first in time. Now one gone in the top of the sixth. Now batting the left fielder, Jesse. One out, base is empty. Freddie Freeman now at the plate. Freddie Freeman. Here comes the 0-1. Out to short. Throw on to Olsen, and Freeman is retired. Well, on the mound, now very that, efficient. That, able to produce an outcome, it seems like, within hey. the third or fourth pitch of just about every. One gone runner at first. Next to hit, King Tejada. Hey, let her rip, let her rip. Swing and a ball popped up, and it drops in. And the postseason success continues for him. Didn't take long to get a result for that at bat. That's a ball that a lot of times you'll see the shortstop or left fielder be able to get to if it hangs up in the air long enough. But right there, it just died and found a way to drop in on the green stuff with base hit. One down. Here's the left fielder, Jesse Winker. That one missing inside. Could be some action here on this next pitch. Couple runners on. Probably a challenge pitch coming. That one in for a strike, two and two. Wow, just a beautiful backdoor slider right there. If you've got any chance of hitting that pitch, you have to wait until the absolutely last millisecond. Just a tough pitch to hit and not an easy one to throw either. Vargas to second, and it's a double play to end the inning. Nothing across on two base hits. No errors and one left on. Last half of the eighth coming up. It's the Braves 11 and the Dodgers 1. Terrific job in this game. He scattered two hits and pretty dominant. Efficient with his pitch count. Got himself all the way to the finish line and finished what he started. So Singy, as the numbers show, a great performance on the mound in this one. Absolutely, and that really set the tone from the beginning. A fantastic effort. An 11-1 final. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long.